WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 m update, and we've got a sea of green. All the U.S. indices are trading to the upside. Dow up 195 points, about half a percent. The S&P half a percent or 22 points. The same for the NASDAQ. That's 78 points. And for the Russell, that's about nine points. Semis are basically flat. They're up two points. Trannies are up eight bucks. No big deal there. Gold is up six dollars. Silver's off a penny. Lights we crude is up fifty cents. Natural gas up a two pennies, three pennies, trading out two fifty-nine. Uh, Thirty-year treasure up one point, trading out one twenty-one eleven. Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin with the ES mini upper left hand corner. What do we know about this? Well, it's got a Rhodes momentum indicator top. That's led to a consolidation with inside its bullish structured daily profile. That bullish structured profile has supported 4507 to 4524. It was tested and rejected yesterday, being rejected again today. A close above 4524 today is going to suggest to you and I that price wants to make a move back to the top of that daily profile, 4609. Now, if that spot volatility closes below the 50-day exponential moving average. The 50 days at 1476. Low today has been 1478. We're trading at 1492. Watch 1476. If price closes below that and the ES mini closes above the center of its profile, which it will, that's going to tell you about a further rally. I wouldn't want to be short over the weekend. Is that basically what that would be signaling to us? Now, if the spot volatility remains above its 50-day exponential moving average at 1476 and you are short, then you would stay short over the weekend. We take a look at the NQ. That is really the problem trout out here. No bottoming pattern or anything. Price being below the bottom of its bullish structure daily profile for more than two consecutive sessions. And so it's trading into its resistance zone. The zone is between 15,586 and 15,681. If price can close above 15,681, that would say that whatever rally is underway is more than a counter trend move. The US dollar index is likely going to form a sell the D point pattern today. It's formed in a three river evening star pattern at least it is as of 11:02 a.m there is a new profile that's attempting to form its profile levels have shifted during the morning we won't get a confirmation of this profile until monday but right now the buyers are hanging out at 100.78 this uh, center of its profile where it's trading right now is 101.72 a close below 101.72 u.s dollar index likely headed to 100.787 folks stay tuned for the trader's Z show but if you have to start your friday please have a fantastic one be safe out there and we'll look forward to speaking with you again soon take care now